Hello everyone, Sean Kenny back playing some more Goddess, and our uh, explorers have unearthed this relic, and that expanded our territory a bit, so uh, we have a lot more to explore. I've uh, unearthed a bunch of boxes, we've leveled up as well, and uh, have another god card, so that keeps beeping at me. Uh, this is the, the family card. Alright, so there goes uh, the felt that we've uh, been collecting, and uh, I know we have meat. I think we still need, yeah, obviously we need more candles. Alright, fair enough. Uh, they've also uncovered this relic, which I think is going to expand territory over here. Uh, so we'll check this one out. Yeah, land expansion. Oh, right on. So I have a whole lot more to explore. Uh, a bunch of boxes that we're going to have to uh, uh, check out. Um, all my um, houses have generated uh, bubbles, so let's... Uh, I don't know if I have enough houses yet, but uh, let's give it another try. Uh, let's <laughs> have a listen. these guys out and um, well getting closer wow starting to get all kinds of uh, belief now one thing I'm definitely starting to notice uh, as you can see uh, we've been building up this area a little bit um, but there is no activity uh, with your village I mean it's it's just totally static um, and if you do have people wandering around they just end up dying so I, I'm hoping this is one of those, you know, it, it's beta thing, but yeah, it seems to be getting a lot of, uh, uh, you know, been saying that a lot lately, and, uh, you know, it, it is, I'm guessing, uh, apparently when we get settlements, uh, our people will be able to wander the streets, and it will look a little more lively, but as it is now, right, I mean... Look, everyone just goes in their homes, and uh, they don't leave their homes. Uh, these people that, oh yeah, they lost their house up here or something, maybe I'll have to play around with uh, expanding a little bit of territory, make, make a home for them or something. But even still, like it, I mean, you know, it's not even like they wander, it's not like they're going out and fishing um, or chopping down trees, so, uh, you know, definitely... A little annoyance with that because it it is looking pretty dead. Um, we have done a few of those Mount of the Gods things. I guess we might as well uh, see what's in all the chests here. Maybe we can get a, a new level up or something. Uh, plaster. There we go. All right, mud brick lodges. So I guess we're going to have to uh, destroy a bunch of our houses again and um, and get them rebuilt. So that that'll be great. I'm, I'm sure. That Everyone's going to love that. So larger abodes, yay. Okay, cool. Uh, what else do we have around here? Some flint, okay. That'll get us, uh, one, if we get one more flint, uh, hopefully we have a bunch of chests. So uh, there's a plaster. Uh, we have the plaster. Uh, kindling. Meat. Okay. Plaster. All right. So uh, more stuff we currently don't need. Maybe we'll need it in the future. But uh, like we collected a bunch of felt and we did end up using it. So animal furs. I think that's for. Uh, okay, calendar. So we just need two more candles for a calendar. Oh, there's another candle. One more. Uh, Maybe we'll have a, a bunch of upgrades here. This might be nice. Uh, now I don't know what this is. Um, Maybe it's like copper? 
mean, that would kind of make sense if it's if we're going to be leveling up through the ages. Or, or, I mean, I, if it's if it was lava, I would expect the trees to be on fire. So maybe uh, we'll, we'll have to get people to check that out. A bunch of wolves. We'll have to take care of the wolves and uh, another candle. All right, so we got calendar. Uh, what's this going to? I think this gives us our. Oh yeah, day night cycle. All right. Um, so now we have day and night. P apparently they were living in perpetual light. Uh, so that's that's great. Um, <laughs> day night cycles. Excellent. Okay, all that work. Uh, uh, kindling. I guess that's going into the bank and. Uh, now we have new territory to explore. Uh, there's a chest looking for these cards. Timber. Break up all the rocks. Let's, uh, let's check out. Oh yeah, we also, I think in the last episode, we had, uh, yeah. Oh, we got stature speed, right? But finger of God, oh, it costs 10k. Wow, 10k is that like per click? Like what the hell? All right. Yeah. So that can can I do? No, that's literally it. To set one f tree on fire um, costs ten thousand belief. Well, I, I'm, I'm all, I, my only hope is uh, that you know I guess each generation of building is going to start generating way more belief than, than they currently are. Because uh, wow, all right. That was basically, you know, all the belief of all my villagers for uh, whatever the period of time you know, for them to all, for, for the last 40 minutes or something. I don't hear that, like, whispering. That's weird. We have animal furs. Alright. More animal furs. Uh, looks like there's something in here. Sounds like someone just died. <laughs> they, uh, yeah, making good use of the Wilhelm scream, uh, which I'm sure if you've watched any movie where anyone dies in the last uh, 40 or so odd years, you've probably heard the Wilhelm scream. Uh, this thing must be really deep. Ah, I think there might even be two of them. Uh, it keeps wanting to expand back this. And I want to go deeper. Uh, look, we get there. We go. We need to get. We need to get to the next level. All right. Uh, all that for meat. Uh, that was some well buried meat. Okay. Um, oh, there's there's some more. I'm gonna have to chop some trees down to get to it. Meat. Uh, more meat. We have uh, all the meat. Okay. Is that, that all this uh, new area has to offer? Uh, we have the, this new uh, totem, of course, or whatever this is, to uh, check out. Leave that, well, get rid of that burnt tree. Um, yeah, okay, so I think the goal for the next, uh, next episode is I'm gonna, oh, let's send some people up here. I can do this in this episode here. Oh no, I wanted to activate it, and let's get some people out. Uh, I'm sort of been slowly continuing to work. I'm trying to get this all leveled up. I'm thinking I'm going to be... Um, this plateau is going to be a couple layers higher, but I want to try and smooth that out so we have sort of like another big, large settlement um, as we get edge closer and closer to being able to actually cast settlements. I guess what that's going to be able to do is we'll be able to put down a settlement and it'll funnel all the houses within its area into one collection point, which is um, is going to be great because, uh, well, it's, it's fun clicking on 
at the houses for a little while, it, it, it is kind of getting... Uh, you know, if, if every time I want to do something, I'm, I'm having to constantly scan over an ever-growing metropolis. Uh, it's, uh, it's been, you know, especially where, you know, these cast, these recharge times are now in like the 30 minute mark here. It's, uh, yeah, you have to get that totem. You build that house there. Uh, you know, it, it's gonna, uh, I, I don't necessarily want to be spending all my time doing that. Uh, you know, they've already sort of shown that maybe they're going to be, you know, as part of the leveling up process is, is, is unlocking aspects of the interface. Which, uh, you know, I, I can't, I can, if, if it's handled well, I don't mind it. Uh, I certainly can think of games where that's been effective, and other games where it, uh, it's kind of annoying. Uh, I'm going to try and get rid of these wolves. I don't want wolves eating my villagers. Oh, a couple boxes I forgot about up here. Some, some more kindling. Anything, anything decent. No, it's all all kindling up in the mountains. Now, I think somewhere around here there seems to cause I don't know if it's just maybe it's just the totem. Well, I don't hear anything now. But there's been like when I was here before, I heard like whispering. I don't know whether there's going to be enemies that come into play. Uh, I mean, so far it's going into those events of the gods, um, but we'll see, I guess. There's there's that other totem on the right-hand side that we're going to have to get explored. Uh, they are working on this. That's going to take 25 minutes, um, or I could pay five of those things. I'm not going to do that. Uh, we also have this. This is the Shrine of Multiplayer, so I guess I'm going to have to get some people up here to... Um, to get that all exposed, and uh, I'm gonna have to try out some multiplayer games. Uh, as I've heard, that's kind of the only way to to progress into the later stages at this point. Um, hopefully, that's only a beta consideration, and that they want people to to play the the multiplayer version, you know, so that it gets some play testing. Um, <laughs> if that's going to be what the you know, if, if you have to play multiplayer, and, uh, you know, if you're not real good, you're not interested in it, and that locks you out from progression in the rest of the game, I, uh, I, I can't, I'm not a fan of that, that's for sure. Uh, so, uh, we'll see how it works, though. Uh, this is beta as it is now. Um, so, like I said, giving it a chance. So far... You know, I see possibility. <laughs> uh, you know, that's uh, part of the reason why I left these trees. I mean, otherwise it just gets a monotonous sea of s little uh, houses and, you know, uh, a little bit of variety once in a while. And, and hopefully uh, my uh, persistence at, at being for being nice to trees will pay off in the future. Currently, it's not. Um, actually, oh, no, I want to deactivate that. They're, they're working along fine. Uh, oh, someone died. That's too bad. And, uh, alright, so um, once again, I'll we'll probably skip ahead. Uh, I'll be smoothing out this area so that we'll have a nice, nice big cityscape uh, with ra just a, a slightly raised plateau, uh, smoothing out some of these bumps. And uh, I'll be getting people to expose these, uh, see if I, uh, all these temples, I'll, uh, I'll hold off on clicking them and, and we'll have a big old click fest at the beginning of the next episode. So I'm Sean Kenny playing Goddess. Thanks for watching. So long for now.